Well, hello and good evening everybody. Hope everybody's doing fine. So, tonight I've been messing with WinUAE. I managed to do something I've been wanting to do for a long time. And that's link two separate WinUAEs together so I can, you can play games multiplayer like Stunt Car Racer. Now, I didn't realise that it was implemented. I've been looking on the internet to see how you can do it. And I can't find many videos to show you. But it's really easy to do. So, I'm just going to do a quick tutorial video showing you how it's to do it. So, the first thing you need to have set up is WinUAE um, with all the um, workbench, ROMs, etc. Uh, sure, like I said, there's plenty of videos on YouTube that show you how to do this. So, once you've done that, the first thing you need to do is open WinUAE, but also then open another instance of it. So, we end up with two WinUAEs open like this. I just select the basic configuration for the A500 Plus just to play the image that I want to play, which is Stunt Car Racer. You then go down to I.O. Ports, and where it's a serial, you make the one on the, the left the master, and the one on the right the slave. Then select the game you want to load. So, like I say, we'll choose Stunt Car Racer. Uh, de -de -de -de. Not strip poker. <laughs> Where is it? Stunt car racer. So we'll go for that one. Make sure it's also loaded on the second one. Move down to it. So it's that one there. Click OK. Make sure that obviously the display is window so you can see them both. On both ports, sorry, uh, display and it's windowed. Uh, make sure I've got my game port set up for this one. So I'll set the Xbox One controller. Obviously, you can set that one to a different um, controller if you like. Then, if you click start on both of these to start them loading, I'll put these next to each other so you can oh, so you can see them loading. I think I'll change the size of that one. Now oh, that's better. A bit bigger. So it's loading up now. Make sure you click back into that one. Obviously, to come out of it with your mouse, you press the middle mouse button and it will release it. Release the mouse. It might be different on your setup, but so then it loads both instances up. You then click on computer link. Press enter. It'll say link in. So then go over to this side. Press 3, computer link, and it says link complete. So if you go back into this one, and then it, you press space, and it will ask you to enter the name. So if I put two names in, so retro1, enter another driver, retro2, press enter, and go to continue. It then says please wait, and then if you notice, it will bring it up on the other one, the players. There you go. So you've got Retro 1 and Retro 2, and now they're linked together. So now you can start the racing season, pressing 3. And enter. Start the game, and you can see I'm racing against myself. So it's a little ramp we're on. This is brilliant. I've been wanting to do this for years. I didn't realise it was so easy. Now, you might call me a noob. I've looked on YouTube and I can't find any videos to show you how to do it or anything. Perhaps it's that easy you don't need a video, but I do. <laughs> so if you look on the right screen, you'll see me drive off. There I am, look. So, obviously I've not got the joystick set up with the other person, but you can race against each other. You'd probably have it better if the screen was the other way around, so it's on the right side. But yeah, that's how easy it is to play multiplayer games. I'm going to test some other games as well. Oh, not looking what I'm doing. Um, test some other multiplayer games like Lotus, see if it works with those. So, thank you very much for watching. If you found this video useful, then please subscribe and like. I do live streams most uh, weekends on a Sunday. This Sunday is going to be a good one because I've got my brother coming round. And I'm going to play some old games against him. If you've not seen the first one, you need to watch it. I've never laughed so much in all my life. 
Um, just trying to remember how to play games. So thank you very much for watching and I shall see you again soon.